Guys, we talk a lot about proper downswing sequencing and what exactly should start the downswing. However, before we even do that, we need to make sure that we're sequencing our backswing properly. So today, I'm gonna to show you the most important takeaway move to help you create separation between your upper and lower body and improve your downswing sequencing. One of the key aspects of the downswing sequence is the ability to separate our upper and lower body. Okay? This helps us to create torque in our downswing and allows us to generate massive amounts of club head speed. The greater the separation between our upper and lower bodies, the more club head speed we should be able to generate. However, if I don't have that separation in my backswing, then I'm not gonna be able to create that slingshot effect in my downswing. Players today will get into their setup position, okay? And then as we begin our takeaway, both my upper and lower bodies move together. A lot of times in this position, I see the left knee move towards the golf ball. By moving both my upper and lower body, I'm not going to have the ability to have any separation at all. My hips and upper body turn the same amount, right? and then from here, I'm forced to lift my arms to complete my backswing. Now, as I start my downswing with my lower body, I don't have any torque created. I'm not able to create that slingshot effect that I need in my downswing. So instead of turning or moving away and moving that left knee, let's rotate our upper body first. You now see that as I do this, my left knee hasn't moved. I'm creating separation between my upper and lower body and my shoulders and my hips. So now I'm going to continue my upper body rotation and allow my hips to begin to rotate. I'm now in a position to create separation between my upper body, my lower body, and I can actually finish my upper body rotation instead of just lifting my arms to complete the backswing. So you can't properly sequence your downswing until you've actually sequenced your takeaway and backswing properly. Create this separation between our upper and lower body to generate massive amounts of club head speed and get that effortless power that everyone is looking for.